guys, today I'm going to show you how to water marble your nails. It sounded weirdish. But, um, so what you're going to need, first of all, is a cup or a bowl full of room temperature water. And you don't want to use any good bowls, like china bowls or anything like that. Because as you can see, you get nail polish all over it. And then you're going to need any colors that you want to use. I'm going to use black, white, and yellow. And you need tape, and you need a pencil or a toothpick. I'm going to use a pencil because I don't have a toothpick. So first of all, um, you need to tape off your nail, and you need to... Uh, oh, I forgot I already ripped the piece. Well, this stuff's confusing. So you need to rip it off. And then if you risk it really big like I did, you can attempt to rip it in half. Or not. So then, <laughs> um, you can tape off your nail like this and wrap it around so that you don't get any on the back of your nail. And then you need to get another piece of tape. I'm not going to rip it as long. Ow. <laughs> Sorry. And then you need to tape it, you see, like up here, so that you don't get any on the sides of your nails, because that would be really annoying. I know it would bug me. And then you want to wrap it around and have it wrap the other side, too. You want to make sure that this tape is, like, really tight so that you don't get any anywhere, but don't, like cuff circulation to your finger. You want another small piece so that you <laughs> so that you can tape right up here. So it, like you don't get any underneath of your nail. And then after you've taped that off, you want to start by now your water should be room temperature. That looks weird. So you want to start dropping in your nail polish. I'm going to start off using black. And I'm going to use white. I'm going to put a small drop in. That wasn't enough, Heather. You know what, whatever, I'm going to do it. And then you need to put a small drop in like that. Not as small as my sister did it. And then you put in another drop of your other color. You can use as many colors for this as you want. Okay, Heather, I'm going to put in the rest of the colors. Whatever. You can use as many colors for this as you want. I'm only going to use three, though. Make sure it spreads out. And you can add another color. Thanks, Heather. And see, it spreads out. You don't need too much to make it spread. See, like that, I put in way too much. You can barely see the white that I put in before it, but it's okay. And then you can finish wherever you want to. I think I'm going to finish with a yellow in the middle. Actually, I'm going to add a black. It's too much yellow. And then after that's done, you take your pencil or your toothpick or whatever you're using and you drag it in the middle and it doesn't matter if you mess up a little bit because that just makes it more unique. See, it sort of looks like a flower. And then you want to you want to take your finger that you're going to paint and then you're going to stick it in and then take your pencil and pull all the excess nail polish away from your finger. And then you're going to lift up and you got your design. And now I'm just going to tape. Forgive me if it takes a while. Actually, it's not taking as long as I anticipated. Okay. So then you take it all off. And then you have your nail. 
So, thanks for watching, and I hope that you can have fun doing this. My sister's putting in some nail polish. Whatever. Okay, thanks. Bye!